Swag TV Cooking Plus More Hands. Thursday to everybody. Today we're doing a seafood boil. You know what I mean? So if you're new to the channel, welcome. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Smash the like button, man. Give this video a thumbs up. Share us out, man. Why? Because sharing is caring. Drop down in them comments. Let us know what you thought. Let us know what you think. And let us know what you're thinking. And last but not least, drop down, get your eagle on, and hit that post notification bell. You know what I mean? So you'll always be notified. When we upload a video. There you go. If you're already part of the fam, the Swag Life family, welcome back. Hey, man, you know how we do on this side, man. There ain't no need to repeat it. Ain't no need to keep saying it. You know what I mean? So without further ado, B, we're going to bless the hands, bless the food, and we're going to get into the video. All right? All right, man, what's good? What's poppin'? What's Gucci? What's goody in the hoodie? You know what I mean? Like I said tonight, man, we got a seafood boy. You know what I'm saying? Seafood boy with that quarantine love. You know what I mean? <laughs> you did? Got to see. We, I'm, I'm talking about, yo, we got a smorgasbord in this thing, man. We got lobster tails, snow crab legs, corn, shrimp, potatoes. The works, B. You know what I mean? Let wifey get what she gonna get. Tonight, man, got a... Um, True crime update, true crime story. You know what I'm saying? Something that has happened in recent years. You know what I mean? I don't know if any of you all are familiar with the college admission scandal. But uh, it got brought to light when it was found out that Lori Laughlin, Laughlin, not Laughlin, my bad, and Felicity Huffman mm -hmm. had um, pretty much were making... What they felt as though, what they were led to believe as legitimate donations to they knew there wasn't no donations. university. Uh, <laughs> they knew there wasn't no donations. You know what I'm saying? Trying to quote unquote get a fast track head start for their kids to go to college, to go to the top schools, and anything like that. But the update is read this earlier, took notes on it. Uh, Lori Laughlin. For those who don't know who Lori Laughlin is, she plays uh, Uncle. Je she played Uncle Jesse's Uncle Jesse's girlfriend on Uncle Full House. House. You know what I mean. And for those who don't know who Felicity Huffman is, she was one of the main characters on the long-running television series Sex in the City. Yep. Um. Pretty much, man. Uh, Lori Laughlin. She wants the case tossed out. You know what I mean? Over government misconduct. And uh, if found guilty, she could be facing up to 50 years. So, man, like I said, we're going to go ahead and get into it. You know what I mean? Pay me <laughs> that bag right there, baby. The bag? Yeah. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? And uh, it's pretty much crazy, man. You know what I mean? Lori Laughlin and her husband, uh, Massimo Giannulli. You know what I mean? Um... Uh, they pretty much, like I said, they had made a $500,000 donation. Uh, and the reason why you're not hearing anything, if you followed it, if you know about it, the reason why you're not hearing anything about Felicity Huffman is because she bit the book. You know what I'm saying? She owned up to what she had did. Yeah, she did her time, got out and everything. Like what you said, she's done her time, got out. You know what I mean? All that good jazz. So... Like I said, her lawyers want the case dismissed. The government misconduct was presented in the case. And it's threatening to have uh, some grave consequences. You know what I mean? If um, For the defendants, which is Lori Laughlin and her husband. Uh, pretty much lawyers, uh, Laughlin's lawyer said that... Uh, I got skin and everything falling off. It's all good. <laughs> Said while the accusations 
that the feds were presenting. Um, to the scam charity founder, creator, William Single. You know, he was pressured and pushed to implicate Laughlin and Huffman in what would you call that? Racketeering charges? Mm -hmm. Pretty much racketeering charges. And, um, you know, like I said, they pretty much now Felicity, her donation wasn't as um as large as Laughlin's was. No, because her her child was actually had the grades, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. To get yeah. And for those who don't know, uh Felicity Huffman, her husband is Frank from the Showtime series Shameless. You know what I mean? So it's a big it was a big thing about it. Lifetime they didn't. He didn't know nothing about it though. He was un unaware of everything that was going on. Exactly. And that's the crazy thing about it because you know how many spouses have gotten you know what I'm saying? Now they weren't the only two people that did it. You know what I'm saying? Felicity Huffman and uh Lori Laughlin. They weren't the only two individuals that did it. It was um pretty much Buddy was going up and down the West Coast. You know what I'm saying? Pitching this program. You know what I'm saying? And things like that to get this money. They the ones that got caught and made everybody, you know, didn't, yeah. shine, didn't shed the light on everybody else. Exactly. And like I said, Lori Laughlin, her attorneys basically want the case dismissed because he's trying to say that the government, the feds, the FBI, went about getting, I guess, dual confession the wrong way. So... They were given a heads up in when they first got indicted about when the trial would be set. And the trial is set for early September, I mean early October of this year. And the judge on the case, Judge Nathaniel um hold on. Yeah. Judge Nathaniel, um, I gotta write dude's name down in the notes up there. Anyway, he told the attorneys that a part of the indictment that'll be trying Lori Laughman and Massimo that, um, They'll have their trial date set as early as um early October, October 5th, I believe it was. Mm -hmm. And he told all the acting attorneys on the case that everything should be set in stone and done well before Thanksgiving. My thing is, bro, if they keep investigating and finding, you know what I'm saying, dirt, because my thing is, she acted like she had no remorse, you know what I'm saying, for what she's done. You know what I'm saying? She was put in a light to be shown as a racist. And you would think that as many people that supported her and the Full House cast and crew, you know what I'm saying, for as many years as they did, that, um, you know, that she'll be a little bit more. I guess you could say apologetic. But ultimately, they've been proclaiming their innocence the whole time. You know what I'm saying? And um, They went to the extreme of lying about their daughter being in sports and everything. Took pictures of this girl. <laughs> and it was just actually funny because... I've been really trying to keep up with the case because, like I said, when Lifetime aired the movie,
I didn't know anything about it. I did. <laughs> Prior to Lifetime. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Running the trailer ads and everything like that. So. I did. I was shocked when I saw that it was famous people tied up. And I was like, what? I heard about this, but didn't know, you know. Exactly. But yeah, man. And there's a lot of people in that case, like non famous as well. Yeah. Doctors. You know. Like I said, he went all up and down the West Coast. He did. You know, uh, running this scam. And he got, once everything was said and done, I believe he got in the upwards of. You know what I'm saying? Almost $5 million mm -hmm. from the donations. But they weren't donating to nothing, though. <laughs> yeah, to his pocket. Exactly. You know what I mean? Because <laughs> he was telling them stuff like, yo, well, this is what you need to do. You need to get such and such enrolled in sports. And, mm -hmm. You know what I mean? All of these different type of stuff like that. And I'm like, yo, I would just send up here bugging because I'm like... <laughs> Fam, where was Rosalind at when Buddy was doing this? <laughs> you know what I mean? Where was Mom Dukes when she was doing this? When Buddy was doing it? Got that lobster tail, yo. But yeah, man, dozens, dozens of parents, including, mm -hmm. like I said, Lori Laughlin. I keep calling this woman Laughlin. Laughlin and Felicity Huffman. And like it's already been said, you know what I mean? Felicity. She went on. She pled guilty. She did her time. Exactly. She, threw, she, she didn't got out. She apologized. You know she what I mean? She back in movies. And she back, <laughs> back working. You know she what I mean? back in movies. And I knew she would because of the simple fact she faced the, faced the music. Exactly. But you know what pissed me off, though? Went out and got this seafood, these, uh, these crab legs today. <laughs> so, when Dixie, they pulled the okie doke. And what I mean by the okie doke here, fam, you already know what the okie doke is. The way they had them placed in the bag, it looked like it was, like they had some sides on them. It was a lot of them. <laughs> and I'm sitting up here like, yo, I get the bag Looks to the like they're going to be meaty. Exactly. Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, man, it was crazy because when I read the story today, I was tripping because I'm like, yo. This heifer still being. Okay, girl, do your time. I'm real about the situation. The other woman that went to Felicity that did her time. <laughs> girl, go do your time. You, you know, know what I mean? You know you was wrong. This ain't your local, you know what I'm saying, local police department. This is the feds. That's why I said, do the, your time. Stop playing. She should just go on and do her time. The technology that they have to pull up records and review records and everything like that is like, yo, it's so much more high tech than your local police department. I feel as though she should go on and do her time because it was wrong. You got to think about all these other students who... Would have loved to, you know, who, who place they took. Exactly. Because they was taking kids' place that had already got in. And that was the thing about it. And out of those students that had already gotten in, majority of those students were students of color. Yep, minority. You know what I'm saying? Minority. So it was like, my thing is, I feel as though that she should do jail time just off the strength of her having the 
nonchalant attitude and saying, well, you know, basically, F your kid. Yeah. My kid needs to be there yes. more than yours. Yes. You know what I'm saying? And see, yes. the crazy thing about it is the student that, or the, 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 her child, the student that she had that she was doing all this for, really wasn't all that bright. You know what I mean? No, her oldest daughter was. They and weren't. Her oldest daughter got in hands down. But that daughter didn't. Exactly. You know what I mean? She has made no qualms about wanting to go to college. Mm -mm. Or anything like that. But you do all this. You pay into this fake. You know what I mean? Donation or charity program. And then you have the gall and the audacity to be like, yo. Basically saying anything your kid can do, my kid can do better. I hope she get them 50 years for wasting the court's time. Exactly. I really do. You know what I mean? But yeah, man. Uh, real quick shout out alert. Uh, shout out to one of our subscribers named Tom. You know what I mean? <laughs> Who have Tom? Is Tom the bone? I forget how, <laughs> how long Tom has been subscribed to us. But... You know, whenever he posts a video, he might not watch it the same night. You know what I'm saying? The yeah, same we post. The same day, even. But he He's always come, come back and watch it. He do. And shout out to those who... These were. I shouted her out before. You know what I mean? Shout out to Janubia68. Yep. Shout out to all shout of the... You know what I'm saying? Shout out to each with Fifi. You know what I mean? Because she's been rocking with us for a minute. Yes. You know what I mean? Shout out to... And she had good content. Exactly. You know what I mean? Go check her out. Like I said, man. She do like me. She cook. So to, go check it out. To become part of the Swag Life family. To be a member. You know what I mean? If you want that shout out, man. All you got to do is like, leave the first comment. Comment. Be the first to comment. You know what I mean? Also, shout out to uh, Extina Grubbs. She shared us on her community tab because she she didn't necessarily challenge us. No, you know but I mean? we did her challenge. But we were the first to do her challenge. And it was fun. It was. You know what I mean? But yeah, man, I was actually baffled by... Everything that I read in the report because. Back to the college scandal. It was like, yo, chick, you. You did all of this and you don't want to own up to it. Exactly. But you got caught. No matter how you got caught, you got caught. Exactly. You know. It didn't say in the report what happened to the guy who had created the. Um, I think he got a plea deal. He did because he turned over everybody that gave him money. You know what I'm saying? And honestly, on the real, if I was the judge, I would have gave him some jail time too. But he didn't turn over them names without calling them warning them. He warned all of them. Yeah, he did. He did. And that's the crazy thing about it, Joe. He, like, like wife, he said, he called and warned everybody. everybody. And Laura. Try to, she gets on the phone and try to act like she don't know what he's talking about. Exactly. And it was super crazy, but it was still a good movie. You know what I mean? I'm glad they let us know. You know, who's all in, entitled, who's all entwined with all that. Exactly. Music. Mm 
Oh, and they hit the fan with <laughs> Felicity. <laughs> Frank looked at Felicity like, what the hell have you done? Okay. <laughs> He told him straight up, that's jail time. That's prison time. Okay. That's fed time. <laughs> Save it, doll face. That's <laughs> jail time. Okay. And that's the way he looked at her like, uh, you know you're going to prison, right? Okay. <laughs> because in the depiction of the movie, they tried to make it seem well. They didn't try to make it seem that's how it really was. You know that uh, we just call him Frank. I I believe he didn't know nothing about it because you know of the way I mean? he looked at her and what he said to her. That's what that's what got him off. That's why they didn't try him at all. Cause they the FBI had that on video. Him say, telling her she's go that's prison time and she going to prison. The depiction of William <laughs> H Macy. That's his name. That's his government. William H Macy. The depiction that they had him. Depicted as in the movie, he was a lawyer. Mm -hmm. uh, they did that to throw you about I'll show you about. Yeah, mm -hmm. you know he was a uh, lawyer that worked for this big firm out in L.A. and everything like that. You know, and the and the school that Lori. And Felicity was gunning for for their daughters to get in was USC. Mm -hmm. I think with for love with uh Felicity, no, with uh Lori, you know, even though she has two daughters in real life, one of the Children was depicted to be a boy in the movie on Lifetime. But my thing is this. <clears throat> soon as I get this locked out of here, I'm going to tell y'all what it is. <laughs> but my thing is this. You don't know how many lives that ruined. Yes. In the aftermath of everything. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because that shit started like a whole investigation. You know what I'm saying? Into yeah, a lot of the professors students that had got into school, into different schools around the country, because this was something that he wasn't just doing on the West Coast. You know, he was going all over. Yeah, because he was doing it before the West Coast. He was already doing it. You know what I mean? So, it's crazy, yo. <clears throat> Starting to get a little full, yo. Yep. You know what I mean? But, yeah, man. Just wanted to bring y'all this seafood boy with this quarantine love. <laughs> you know what I mean? Got to go pick up one of the kitties from work. And uh, but yeah, man, we appreciate you kicking it with us. Always supporting, always showing love. You know what I mean? You know who it is, man. It's your host with the most, the Bunny and Clyde of YouTube. Swag like TV. Lady Swag TV cooking plus more. Make sure you subscribe, like, share. Comment. Give the video a thumbs up. Hit that bell. You know what I mean? Share us out, man. Most definitely share us out. Share, share, share. Because sharing is caring. Because sharing is caring. And plus it's free. Exactly. You know what I mean? But yeah, man. You know the motto. Keep it splashy. Keep it classy. You know what I mean? And I always remember. Love little life. It's your host with the most, the Bonnie and Clyde of YouTube. <laughs> Swear like TV. Lady Swag TV, cooking plus more. I'm a people person.